I joked just out the back getting myself a coffee and I ran into Patrick Keane. Oh. <laughs> AFL media boss. He will be requesting by the end of tonight's Bud's pass back. Oh. He hasn't seen <laughs> the funny side of what's Bud said oh, earlier tonight at no. all. Good. Oh, come at on, all. Paddy. I said, Paddy, oh. good. March in here and take it well, off him while it's round his neck. Him, I've look, seen him do this before. And he look, carries through. He I look forward think, to Patrick trying to take it off me. Yeah, I'd like to see that. Yeah, like no, but you just, you just remove the access yeah, through the computers it. of your barcode. And then, and then oh, you try and barcode yeah. in, spud and yeah. you bug it. I'll yeah. remove his loaf. <laughs> <laughs> so I like that joke. <laughs> this is the man uh, who Damien Hardwick might have uh, yeah. just well, taken the edges off. But then spud questioned. His integrity, but because no. he said, I went to a couple of Richmond games earlier this year, Patrick. Spud goes, oh, yeah, which ones? <laughs> yeah, but it's no use taking it out on me, Patrick. Oh, <laughs> Just because Dinner had a crack at him, he doesn't have to crack the sads on me. Spud, it's because you, you directly questioned well, his integrity. He said he went to a couple of games. And I, you're saying he didn't go to any I games. I want to know which <laughs> specific games they were, Joe. <laughs> it's turned investigative style. Anyone can, yeah, say, yeah. anyone can say a couple of games. Well, I want to know which ones. My, well, I've just spoken to him, Spud, and he's filthy up. Yeah, well, and I said, good. I'll go <laughs> and see him at half time. Actually, I can go out and see him now if you want me to. Did you maybe <laughs> stoke it up a little bit, Jim? Just a little bit? Yeah, yeah, just I, I, just, I just asked how <laughs> he, those comments so, sat with him and yeah. they didn't sit oh, back particularly out, well. So I'll my media award might be forthcoming on Wednesday night. I don't awards, that like crows out in the deck. Paddy Dangerfield did something over in that forward pocket, yes. Jim. He put his head down Jeez, first and flung himself out of the pack backwards. And I was about to go, that's not on. And then he won the ball and kicked the goal that's a contender. And by popular demand, uh, the Wolf Pack have said, Wolf, I demand to hear Jim's call no of the mind, goal. Gary, Let's have a see. listen. It was broken up in the air. Danger comes through. Inside the field of play. Outside of the boot. Bugger off. Oh, he's taking the best yet. Bugger off. <laughs> Danger! Jeez. That's your goal of the year right there. I don't give a stuff what anyone says. Extraordinary danger, Phil. It was unbelievable. You had to see it live to believe what he did. He was outside the field of play and then came back in and then off a step falling away. The outside of the boot banana. Uh, skill. Um, but, it's not, not Wispy Watson yeah. suit. Yeah. Not sure he's getting the job done. It's, no, it's not. It's a real sort of brownie, yeah. mauvey, purpley no. setup. Uh, do you know what he does, Wispy? I'll give you an insight here. Yeah, he please. goes rogue and he goes the home wardrobe. What, he brings his own uh, setting? He brings his own setting no. and he's uh, decided that the Channel 7 no. provided oh, suit wow. is not to the way he likes it cut. Jeez. And that's out of his personal collection. That is controversial because yeah. he's rolling with an RM boot as well. No. And he's got his, obviously, I think Lady Susie's doing his hair at the yeah. minute. Because he's almost given up on that. Yeah, no, he's oh, conceded, he's just, isn't he? He's just Press sense not his strong suit, Wispy, as a rule. Well, he sort of thinks he's a, one of those sort of country farmer, <laughs> squire style yeah. set up. All right, it's been good. Yeah, okay. That's better, isn't it? Get well, prepared for the so, rub yeah. tomorrow. Yeah, enough heavy wolf. Well, it's generally how we roll, isn't it? Friday night. Wrap it up. All right, Spud, it's my understanding you've done the three worst on ground. Yeah, I have. Well, you've got a minute, 14 seconds. So who okay. are they? Uh... Van Burlo, I thought that uh, he he pulled out a couple of times. So didn't even um, have to do this, but just wanted to. <laughs> yeah, fifty six percent. I wasn't I given a chance to have a crack out. Fairly succinct too, isn't it? Right? No. Van Burlo, um, big Tex. Oh, no. And oh, don't geez. think it's nepotism oh, because my nephew spud, played on him. Come on, up, spud, build him up. Your boy JB, well, that is rubbish. I shouldn't have allowed you to do him. No, he had a. A very ordinary night. And it, look, the delivery wasn't great, but as a leader, he um, could have at least bowled a couple over. Which 35 I was, seconds. But <laughs> yeah. And three votes goes to probably a guy that's going to maybe, maybe all Australian on, on Tuesday night. He's had a great year, but he had a <laughs> stinker tonight, Eddie Betts. Oh, Fathers demanded he do these three downs. when no one had to do them. He that's said no. amazing. I'm it. looking forward to Warrior tomorrow. Uh, well, on the coverage tonight, Warriors have had a few bit to say. Do you get that yeah. text? Triple M review oh, for DeWalt. It's still going.